Hey guys, welcome. I'm Nikki and this is Mystical Enlightenment. Today is Thursday, so what goes on on Thursdays? We do an angel card pull. Yes, it's time for angel card pulls. So these are angel messages from our angels, our guardian angels, our archangels, depending on who comes through in the cards. So how does this work if you're new here? What we do is we ask, say a prayer and ask our angels who are always with us we thank them and we ask them to convey messages through the cards for us i will ask you to focus on the cards after i pick three cards i will ask you to focus on the cards and decide which card resonates with you the most after you a few moments i will flip the cards over and read the messages that the cards have so that's how it works. So just a little recap for those of you that are new, for those of you that have been here before, sorry for that. But I just wanted to make sure everybody understands how the cards work. So the cards, the deck I use is actually a combination deck of two of Kyle Gray's decks. So you can find the links for those decks in the description below, as always. And let me ask you, how many of you love Kyle Gray? If you love him and do not file, follow, file, geez, follow his Instagram account, I highly recommend that you follow his Instagram account. It's just amazing. So, yeah, can you tell I really love Kyle Gray? All right, so anyway, I'm sure some of you do. Most of you probably do. All right, so let's get into the reading for today. I'm just going to sweep the cards up. So, let us take a moment to thank our angels for being with us. We know that you are always with us, our guardian angels and our archangels. We thank you for being with us, for being beside us, to the right of us, to the left of us, in front of us, behind us, above us and below us. We thank you for always being with us. We know that you are always with us. Thank you so much. And we ask that today you convey messages that we need to hear, that we may be blocking, that we may be too stubborn to hear. We are open and receptive to these messages now, and we thank you for revealing these messages to us in this space of love where fear does not reside. Thank you, and so it is. Card number one, card number two, card number three, and I'll just give you a moment to focus on the cards and decide which card you feel is calling to you this week. Okay, let's get started. So if you chose this card, this is an Archangel card, and it is Archangel jo Jophiel. Honor your beauty. Thank you, Jophiel, for helping me discover my inner and outer beauty. So this week, maybe some self-care to focus on your beauty, your skin, your health, as well as maybe some meditation to focus on your mental here. If you chose the middle card, you chose Bridget, inner strength, move back to wholeness, recognize you have the power. Look at how beautiful that card is. Simply stunning. I love it. And I'll put the messages, I apologize, um, there's a glare, and my TV is shining in the cards. 
I'll put a message, um, the messages that are written down here, I'll put them in the description below so you can see them. Oh gosh, let's see what the last card says. If you chose this card, ah, oh, Lord Ganesh, my favorite, infinite abundance. Obstacles are being removed. Spiritual support and connections are increasing. Ah, oh, lovely, lovely messages this week. So, absolutely stunning messages this week. Stunning imagery. Gorgeous deck. So, I always like to look at an overlay of the cards. Even though this is not a straight-through reading, I like to see how the collective reading is. Um, how it plays off of each other. So, we have Honoring Your Beauty. Pulling Your Inner Strength and abundance. So when you think about that all together, right? We think about that if you honor yourself and call upon your inner strength, that is what truly when abundance comes into your life. So I like I love the flow of these cards. It almost feels like even though each card is individual for somebody individually, and they're not a collective reading, the reading does flow here. And I love it. And I usually find that in the angel card readings. So I hope you guys enjoyed this reading today. I truly hope you have an amazing weekend and beginning of your week next week. Please go ahead and hit that like button for me. That really, really helps my channel. Um, hit that subscribe button if you have not subscribed to the channel yet. If you would like to see any of my tarot readings or you would like to see any of my unboxings on my oracle cards or tarot cards, or rather not unboxings, flip throughs, I can put a link in this video at 710. Sorry, reminding myself. So yes, blessed be, have a wonderful week, and I'll see you next week for our angel card readings. Bye guys.